you know, Conor McGregor is over here angling for the Mayweather fight, not even in the sport. Yeah. Forget the division, not even in the sport. <laughs> and nobody's really giving him shit, which is funny. But Mayweather officially, I guess, or officially, unofficially, I don't know exactly what yeah. officially means, but he came out of retirement, released a statement saying, stop talking, sign the money on the line. And I believe, I don't know if it's a rumor or if it's confirmed, they booked a venue in Vegas for June. Really? I saw the video where uh, Floyd said that. And he seems to be in England at the moment, judging by all the people in the crowd. In fact, I know he is. He was at some club in Liverpool. Um, doing a little tour around England by the looks of it. But, um, yeah, I mean, I mean, you can't blame Connor for that. Jeez, who wouldn't take that? You know, I mean, win or lose... Well, Connor's got nothing to lose. He's got nothing to lose in that. You know, I mean, you never know. You know, Connor's coming. Uh, sorry, Floyd's coming out of retirement. You know, he hasn't fought for a little bit. Um, Connor's got that big left hand. You know, he's he's got power. You know, and then the the fight is boxing. So you never know. You never know. You can never say never. And of course, both guys stand to make a shit ton of money out of it. So um, yeah, I mean, I, I'm all for it. To be honest, I, I'd love to see it, and I'm all for everybody making money. So good for them. Um, is I it like, going to happen? I don't know because it's so hard. You know, you got so many variables. You got Floyd and Connor; they've got to agree in a purse, and you probably got the UFC to agree on a split. But the UFC are business people as well. WME, you know, if 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 the the pot is big enough and the percentage is equal to a big enough amount of money, then they're not going to say no. You know, so uh, my bet is that that fight will happen. I think it will happen. Will it happen in June? I don't know. That might be a bit too soon. But um, from what I understand as well, I was talking to somebody in Las Vegas, and I heard that uh, Floyd recently got scammed of a lot of money. The number was very, very big. So um, I don't think Floyd needs the money, but he wants to replace this money that he got swindled out of, apparently. Yeah, he- that, I've heard that from a friend of a friend of a friend. Floyd put um, uh, a picture on Instagram that uh, shows his net worth six hundred and fifty million, then Connor's net worth two point five million, and then he wrote, "Before you ask for twenty five million, be worth more than twenty five million. You have a two and a five, right? But you meant to say two point five million, not twenty five million." I uh, <laughs> like rich people are trolling each other with what their net oh, worth yeah. is. <laughs> what a good life! It's crazy. No, but listen, I think it's fair to say. Well, I know, I know for a fact Connor's net worth is more than two point five million, not because. You know, I've studied his books or pried into his uh, private details, but, you know, the numbers he's been doing and the pay-per-view he's been generating, et cetera, et cetera, that net worth is bollocks. <laughs> that net worth is bullshit. That is wrong. Uh, and I'm as sure as that as the sun is going to come up tomorrow after tonight. So, um, yeah, he's worth more than 2.5. How much was Floyd worth again? Six hundred and fifty million. million. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Well, I don't think Connor's worth 650. So he's got him beat. That's for sure. Um, but he's worth more than 2.5. But you're right. What a weird world we live in. Um, but yeah, I mean, I guess that's a chance for Connor really to become the greatest fighter of all time. It really you know is. I, mean? I think it so really too. is because he, you know, love him or hate him. He, he did amazing in the UFC. And then now, if he was to take out perhaps maybe one of the greatest boxers that ever lived, yeah, that would be something. That would be incredible. And you I can't mean, deny it. Look, uh, I'm sure, you know, the uh, the the odds were, are probably astronomical in the favor of Mayweather. Um, but there's something about there's something about Conor McGregor. There, I, I don't know what it is. There's like an it factor, right? You can't put your finger on it. There's something about him that makes me go like, I, I throw all logic out the window where I go like, well, no, he's not going to beat Floyd Mayweather at boxing. The thing that Mayweather is debatably the greatest of all time at. But there's this weird little thing that I can't really put my finger on it that makes me go, I think there's a chance he's going to knock him out. I think there's a chance just something. He's just going to go in there. He's going to throw a big shot. He's going to land it and he's going to change history. It's going to change the trajectory yeah. of combat sports for the rest of you know humanity. And I think if he lands that shot... He, in, in one punch, I think he destroys boxing. I think it kills boxing. Okay, that's it. It's over. Mm. And I believe that No, he- you're right. You're right. The, 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 there is an opportunity for him to do that because that would send the message that there's better fighters in mixed martial arts than what there is in boxing. You're right. Because the, the, the storyline would definitely be boxing versus MMA. And you'd have all the boxing purists 
sniggering to themselves and laughing and saying, this is ridiculous, this joke thinks he's going to come over here and beat Floyd. And, of course, you've got all the, the MMA fans, you know, all hoping for Conor to win. So that would be, uh, it's an interesting dynamic. It really does uh, put a twist on it. But I don't want to spend too much time talking about Conor because um, he hates me. <laughs> no, he doesn't. Does he hate you? No, he doesn't hate you. Yeah, I don't. Well, you, you know, we, we, we have a, a weird relationship. So uh, we'll, we'll move on and we'll switch gears. Yeah. Uh, 